Hi, this is Dr. Gary. Welcome to the Daily Tune-Up today. One of the things that I have got to bring to your attention, the new television season starting right now, and some of the shows are so violent and have so much reality action of the dirty things in life, the nasty things in life, and the underbelly things in life. Did you know that by the time a child is, if they're watching television three to four hours a day, by the time they are 15 years old, they've witnessed 12,000 murders in their own living room? That can't do anything but desensitize a young human being to the reality of how serious that is, along with sex and other crimes. Some of the things on television today are strictly there for entertainment, and watching with a mindful eye cannot be that harmful. However, with young, impressionable minds, I want you to realize if you're not paying attention to what your kids are watching, you're really kind of programming them and desensitizing them to be human beings. Now, I'm not saying everybody that watches this on television is going to end up being a criminal. However, I am saying that it changes their heart. It changes their sensitivity to the seriousness of life. Just watching television, how many times do you see people die on TV or people passing away on TV? Then in real life, somebody passes away and they've desensitized themselves to the real drama of what that means and also feeling what that means. They become kind of desensitized little clones of society. They just don't feel anything. They become very numb. Later in life, this creates a huge problem in our emotional balance and being able to discern problems and challenges as well as handle ourselves emotionally. Today, as the new television season starts on television across the country and around the world, you as parents, even parents of older children, pay attention to what they're paying attention to. And if nothing else, if you can't change what they're watching all the time, at least you can balance it out with good discussions that are going to help them understand what they're really watching. Our children are being brought up into a media environment that communicating is not that important, as long as we can text each other. In fact, another interesting, interesting statistic is that most people, rather than talk on the phone now, would rather text message or email rather than actually talking to someone. The reason is, it's easier, they can get their point across, and there's no confrontation. So we've come to a place now that conversations are really contrived in many people's minds as confrontations or the possibility for confrontation, which destroys our ability to communicate effectively. We've got to start working on this. So if you have young people in the home, pay attention and have some interesting discussions about what they're watching and paying attention to. If your kids are college age, do the same thing. And even for yourself, really watch something that lifts your heart and lifts your spirit rather than the negativity of bringing you down. Like I said yesterday, we have this feeling of impending doom. Well, that's one of the big reasons for it right there is the way we're programming ourselves for disaster and doom. So until tomorrow, this is Dr. Gary wishing you an extraordinary, fun-filled day. Bye-bye.